What's up guys, so I am here in Choa Chi Getting ready to get this history video for you guys So let's go ahead and get this video started And let's learn a little bit of history and travel Show you what it do Oh yeah, loco, escúchame bien Si puedo lograr todo, pues tú puedes también Ahora tengo carros, ahora tengo casas Ahora todo está fluido como sangre de la raza Let me introduce you to the reason So guys, welcome back to another video And today I'm in the town of Choachi Which is not too far from the last history video of Ubaque So if you haven't seen Ubaque, please go ahead and check out that video now <laughs> so let's get started let's learn some history of choa chi and see what's going on Choachi, officially known as San Miguel de Choachi, is a municipality in the town of Colombia in the eastern province of the Department of Cundinamarca. The municipality borders La Calera in the north, Ubaque in the south, in the east, Suomeque, and westward of Choachi is the Colombian capital, Bogota. The town center is located at 38 kilometers, which is about 24 miles from the center of the capital. Within the boundaries of Choachi, the Paramo de Cruz Verde is situated and the climate here is between is around 18 degrees celsius which is about 64 65 degrees fahrenheit on average so a bit about the history the area of Choachi was inhabited by the Southern Muisca, part of the Muisca Confederation ruled by the Sipa of Bacata. The modern foundation of the town was early in the Spanish conquest of the Muisca. In 1560 by soldiers of conquistador Gonzalez Jimenez de Casada. In 1601, a parish was constructed in Choachi. In 1563, the Spanish arrived Juan de Avellaneda. Francisco Lorenzo and Antonio Bermudez, founder of Choachi. Between the 17th and 19th century, the original indigenous population almost completely perished. So just like you saw in the distraction vlog, this is the center park that I was at in the night. So this is what it looks like in the day. Like I said, the primary park of the town. You have the church here behind me. And this is a spot where people come to chill out a little bit. So, what does Chorchi mean? The name, right? The etymology. The name Chorchi is derived from the original name in Chipcha, Chi Gua Chi, which means our mountain of the moon. The Muisca had a strong lunar cult and worshipped the goddess of the moon, Chia in various places across their territories. It is believed that in Choachi, a place of worship to the moon was located. So the name of that church is Paraquia San Miguel Choachi, which is the primary church of this town in terms of the Catholic Church. Also around here you have the government offices. Over there you have the Casa de Gobierno, the government house. And then you have other things around here um, where you can eat. Um, you have some banks and everything else. So yeah, man, come to Chowachi, man.
runs the economy. What fuels this town? Main economical activities in Chochi are agriculture, livestock farming, and mining. Also, tourism, mainly from the capital, is a source of income for the local people. Oh yeah, so I just asked these people, they said I can enter here and look. They said this is like the plaza of bulls, so where they used to fight bulls. And it's like when they do like a, like a festival, they do a festival of bulls. So they said I can come in here and take a look. What else? What's that? Like they're practicing right now. They're practicing the bullfight or something. It's pretty cool. Nice. Oh, no, gracias. Están practicando ahí. Hay dos personas ahí practicando. Ah, sí. ¿Cuándo es la feria? En enero. En enero. ¿Qué fecha? Oh, okay, bueno, te la puedo ver. <laughs> Para verla. Claro. Bueno, gracias. Chao. Bueno, gente. Chao. <laughs> so, the festival is in January. More or less, he said the 10th, 7th, 10th, or 10th, 15th, something like that. So, I might have to come back here in January, man, and see if I can get um, some image of the, I mean, some footage of that for you guys, man. That would be a nice experience. Ah, okay. Bull Festival. Let's go. So one thing that I don't talk about much here is archaeology. In the first half of the 20th century within Chochi, the Chochi stone has been found, possibly in a grave. The stone carved in Lidite may represent the Muisca calendar, a complex lunisolar calendar used by the Muisca. Also petroglyphs have been discovered in Chochi. So guys, I'm back in the spot to have lunch at the same place I had lunch at before. Um, because I just like the price and the food is actually pretty good. Once again, they had good lunch. I do recommend that spot. The name is Restaurant La Ola de Almelo. De Almela. La Ola de Almela. I recommend that restaurant. The people are nice. You get refills on your drink. Hope you enjoyed this history, guys. So, some places of interest are Paramo de Cruz Verde, Mata Redonda Ecological Park, known by the Muisca as Caventuca, El Verjón Lagoon, Laguna del Silencio, La Chorera, El Chiflon, which is a beautiful waterfall, White River, Chi Meaning Aguga Ethnographic Museum, Municipal Cemetery, High of the Virgin, and some paintings. So just to talk to you guys a little bit, um, the owner of the hotel where I was staying at, we had a long conversation. I did not record any of it, but we spoke for about at least an hour. And what we spoke about was basically having a vision. And he was like, this town has so much room for development because people need to have, the people don't really have a vision. So we were talking about investments and we were talking about, um, <laughs> And we were talking about um, just implementing your ideals into something. So basically, if you have a vision, take everything step by step, and you're not you're probably not gonna reap the benefits of it right now. But as long as you have a plan with your vision, then eventually you will be able to reap the benefits of what your plan is. So just have an idea. That way you're not like, oh man, why did I do this? This is a small town. I think I walked around the whole town already. <laughs> if you're in Bogota and you want to take a, a bus out here, this is the bus station. These buses go to Bogota and from Bogota to here. So before this video closes, remember to check out the playlist of all the other towns I have been to and all the other towns that are coming up in the future. So check out the outro, check out the playlist, and let's wrap up this video now. So guys, um, thank you once again for tuning in. 
and I hope you learned a little bit about the history and travel about this town here, Cho A Chi. So I enjoy doing these videos and I hope you guys enjoy watching these. So like always, go ahead and like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will catch you in the next adventure. Also, I'm not sure if I mentioned about the thermals or like the hot springs in Cho A Chi. So the owner of the hotel was also telling me that one major tourist attraction are the hot springs in Choachi. And it's not cheap, but not too expensive. So that's just another thing I forgot to mention.